Pats have been in good form of late. Conan Byrne with the free kick. Simon Madden. Madden gets the cross in, headed away by Hale. It'll come again, though, for St. Pats. It's Conan Byrne. Pats look to spread it again. Once more, it's with Madden. He slides one in for Jake Keegan, but the defender comes across and Piers puts it behind for a corner. Pats a little loose at the back, and that's very loose by Barry Murphy. McAniff spots Patterson unmarked, and Patterson is there to break the deadlock. He'll hardly get an easier one this season. Pats have tended not to panic this season when they've gone behind. They will look, though, to get something from this very, very quickly. Byrne continues his run down the line, and he's found... He's locking up into the box. This time Keegan meets it at the near post. He steals in front of the defender and it's 1-1. Derry looking to fashion another chance in this game. It's Darren Cole. Cole has a lock up. Nicky Lowe gives it back to Darren Cole. Plenty of space, offers him a shot. Oh, it's gone in. Derry are back in front. Darren Cole's deflected effort has beaten Barry Murphy. Pats look to wrestle back the advantage, but breaking it up there is Nicky Lowe. Lowe on as far as Aaron McAniff plays the ball for Patterson. On the mark already, he tried to curl it beyond Barry Murphy and not too far away. It's Toner. Gets it back. Thinks about going himself. Crosses it, though. It's met by Byrne. The pullback. Oh, Hale was there got there just before Markey. Low. Pierce. Hopeful ball forward. Rolls kindly for Derry. Rolls kindly indeed. It's McAniff. The touch takes him away. A little too much though. And the shot comes in from Jack Doyle. Lee Desmond seeks out a teammate. The one there is Simon Madden. Madden's cross. At the back post, it's Darren Cole's shot. Comes back off the post. Madden back into the danger area. Brennan is battling for it. Brennan goes to ground under pressure from Jared Doherty. And Ben Connolly has said that is a penalty. Disputed certainly by the Derry City players. Jared Doherty is completely incensed over the decision. He gets a yellow card for his efforts. All eyes were on the ball. Doherty seemed to push Brennan in the back before getting the punch. And here's the spot kick. Byrne beats Doherty. And Pats are level once more. Mr. Reliable from the spot. Pats are back in this one. What has Conan Byrne got from this set piece? Finds Toner at the back post and Toner bullet-like has angled it into the back of the net and Pats hit the front. Now Conan Byrne in the middle. Finds Thomas Byrne. He has a little bit of space to work with. Back as far as Conan Byrne. Takes the shot himself, takes a deflection but it rolls the wrong side of the post. Pats happy with the ball at their feet. They're in control somewhat of this game, leading by three goals to two. Has Thomas Byrne got something to say about that? A wonderful touch and a wonderful finish from Thomas Byrne. Just his second start for Pats, and he nips in with a goal. Ronan Curtis on as a substitute. Nicky Lowe. Angles one into the box. A mistake there by Pats. It's run clear for Jack Doyle but his shot comes back and Pats somehow scramble it clear Derry will come again this time it's McAniff McAniff is facing the defender he's bearing down on goal as McAniff puts in the cross but there's nobody at the back post for Derry Pats still applying a high press in this game. Do they want a fifth goal? Can they get one? Birmingham with the cross. Not dealt with. Wonderful touch by Markey. Markey with a wonderful goal. Number five for St. Pats. They're hitting all the winning notes this evening.
Yeah, look, we encourage our guys to play up in the back. That's what we do. Uh, everybody knows that. Uh, it was just a blip. Um, we, we def and the second goal that they got, got deflected. That said, the fellas dug in, showed a bit of character. They were all at it for the 90 minutes. Um, and it didn't surprise me that we won uh, because it was so intense. It was a good tempo, better play. And uh, I'm just delighted for them all. You know, you go through little spells when things go against you. And if you have momentum and you lose it, it's, it's impossible to get it back. And from being on top and ready to get into the dressing room at half time with the 2 1 lead, that all changed within the two minutes and it affected us badly. And we didn't perform in the second half at all.